AM 970 WSTX. I've got a surprise for you and for me. I've got a, a guest here. And, uh, you know, when people come into this station, we are very hospitable, okay? I mean, if we had some fry fish and for you to share with them, we would do that too. But, you know, hey, it's, it's, a, it's a studio, right? <laughs> it's a studio, right? Um, and if I had known in advance, then I'd walk with my gooseberry and it, I had some to mm. walk with, you know? But, mm -hmm. hey, so hey, it pays when you come into to WSDX. Planning is always good because they have gooseberry in it and all kind of other good <laughs> things, right? But anyhow, we're talking about culture. And in the course of culture, one of the things you have to mention is talent. And I always tell you about taking the children out and exposing them and giving them the opportunity to see things that you never know what it is they're going to say, well, I like this or I like that and so forth and so on. Well, I have an artist here in my midst in the studio and I want to share you and her with everyone, okay? Um, you always hear about the art displays that are going on and so forth and so on, but it's good every now and then to get up close and personal with someone who does it, and as I understand, they teach also, so you never know. All right, so, Miss Edwards? Good morning. It's all yours. Talk to me. First of all, introduce yourself, okay? And then tell us a little bit about how you got into art in terms of being an artist, you know? Because some people just... You know, when they born, they had the, the paintbrush and they had it. <laughs> and then other people, it's like 30, 40, 50, and they get epiphany and, they, you know, and it just happens, and it just happens yeah. right? So introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about your journey into art. Okay, my name is Renee Edwards. I, um, I'm an art teacher, and I worked for the department of, of about 15 years now. Just, a, just about 15 years. Um, I had... My first exposure, as the earliest I can remember was second grade, and um, I've been I've been pretty profound in my art. It's a developmental thing over the years. Um, I've had the pleasure of being in the midst of great artists, um, and um, just you know, in the stages of my life, just having. Um, very uh, intuitive, you know, glances at my work, intuitive glances at in inspiration from other people and just developing my own style. And, um, but I, I wasn't always, I wasn't always, um, I'm not the sharing kind. So I, it took me a very long time to um, have my work displayed and, and, and I, was, I was not, receptive of constructive criticism when I was younger. So, okay, um, so it would be safe to say you were shy and sensitive? Um, <laughs> no, I'm not shy. I'm not shy. Oh, not shy. Not at all. Okay. Not at all. But I, I am very sensitive okay. about my art. Okay. I'm very sensitive. And um, I am very um, sort of a perfectionist. My mom my mom always tells me I have overdoer's disease. You know, you, in other words, you you might be there taking five years to do something <laughs> that was finished a year ago. Exactly. <laughs> it might it might have my signature on it, and I'm just gonna go back and I'm just gonna keep messing with it well, that's until all good. yeah. That's all good. It's it's who you are and the the pride and concern and care in what you do. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I actually understood a lot of that. Um, my mentor, I had two beautiful profound mentors in my life and they're past now um leo cardi i got him in middle school and i got him in high school and i also had the pleasure of him um critiquing my work back and forth through my earlier co collegiate years and he wow if anybody knows leo cardi he's a, he was a harsh critic but he meant well it was all love but he wanted you to surpass whatever potential you had. You had to go beyond that. And so just, you know, um, having that in me just kept me going. And also Cy Levine, who is also passed. I had yes. him 
in my later um, high school years and also I had him during my teaching career as well so um, just very profound and, and, and innate um, criticism and encouragement and uh, just a whole lot of you know finger shaking and head shaking <laughs> and, and so I, I learned to in, you know internalize that and after 35 years um, you know now getting to my very first showcase I've never shown my work I did show my no correction I was in New Blood two years ago. Oh, okay. Um, I had I had three pieces in New Blood, but it wasn't. Um, it's not my whole body of work. This show, my my debut showcase, um, is compiled of my best body of work. Okay. And within the last two years, I've been really honing in on a different medium and really just trying to develop that. So that's what this body of work comprises about. Okay. So you have an exhibit? I have an exhibit. Um, it's called Strategy, and um, it's uh, it's a, it's news and inspired. I have a muse, and it's it's more inspired of experiences, and um, it's it's thought provoking. Um, it's a bit provocative, and. Um, and, and, and moving actually very spiritually moving okay. so um, that exhibit is going to be on Saturday at Tideway um, Tideway is on King Street in Frederickstadt it's in between uh, 69 it's where, where 840 was back, back then and so it's, it's a beautiful little hacienda it's gorgeous blue, blue and white has on the cross on other side of the street it has a, the mural of the Mukajumbi very beautiful mural so I thought that backdrop was just it, it was like like you said epiphany you know <laughs> well sometimes we have people listening in who are, are visiting um, and so if you could give them a kind of a little bit like a, a, a walking with which way they're coming they're coming from the beach side what do you okay do Pali's, or how, how do you absolutely so if you're if you're on Strand Street you can actually walk through where Pair 69 has this walk through between the dive shop. Okay. And so you just walk straight through and coming that direction, you're gonna to go to the left. There's another dive shop on the other side. Okay, right. And um, it's a blue and white um, building. And right at the end of that block on King Street, once you get to King Street, if you get to Kentucky Fried Chicken, you've, you've gone too far. Right. So you have to just turn back around. And if you're coming from say Rainbow Beach, you're just gonna come straight up King Street and it's on the right. Always just look for the Mokujumi mural on the left side of the street if you're coming from Rainbow. If you go past that mural, you've missed it, you gotta turn back around at First Bank and try again. All right, fantastic. So, uh, you brought some of your art to share I, with us? I did, I actually bought the flyer. Okay. And this, um, the work that's on the flyer is the work called strategy. Okay, well, turn so, the flyer around. So, so that they, I'm going to show it to you. Okay, there. for those of you who are uh, checking me out on YouTube, Douglas Canton on YouTube, there it is. Strategy with a D before the G. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I see that it starts the, the, the 30th mm -hmm. and it's going to run for a period of time. It's good. It's the uh, opening night is at 6 mm -hmm. to 9 and it's going to run for 30 days. Okay. All right, fantastic, fantastic. So um, I'll take a picture of that so I can Absolutely. post it. Absolutely. Or if you have the digital, Actually, you, you can. I can give you that one. Okay, and uh, definitely so I can put it on my Facebook page and help to spread I would the love, word. thank you so All much. Right. I actually have a few sponsors that um, did take part in this. My, of course, my mom, Loretta Peterson, and um, then I have uh, IB Designs. And I have Guan Manier. Um, of course, Taiguay, which is my, my venue. Of course, Taiguay and Santa Carion. That's his place. And, and um, Alfredo is just wonderful, right. wonderful man at Taiguay. And if you guys want like smoothies, lattes, that place is an entire vibe. It's a whole vibe. I sit there and I do, I take my book 
and I just sit in the window and I do my art. So if you see me there, that's that's the vibe. That's that's the entire situation right there. You just sit, you enjoy a latte, you do a drink. They have little appetizers, and you just sit there and enjoy King Street. That's that's pretty much. Well, I I, I did hear uh, cooping your bag over there with the white back to it. I'm wondering if that's some stuff here that you could show. That? Like, <laughs> you know, because you... I have a few pieces. You have a few pieces? Yes, well, hey, you got an I audience, can. and I would love to to share your artwork, a, a little taste of the artwork, and they can come on up and see the rest, okay? Okay, so, so um, there are a number of series that will be exposed at this um, exhibit, um, and this is, I'm going to show you two of the series that's um, being exhibited. Um, this one, this is um, ink on paper. Actually, it's, it's, it's Indian ink and permanent marker. I'm exploring charcoal and ink at this time. So this one is called Wavelength, and this one will be exhibited there. Oh, this right. was in the last two years. The entire body of work is the last two or three years All of right. my life. Hold it sideways. Actually, I'm, it's this way. I know, but I'm, but I'm just asking you. I just wanted to, okay, because it was giving me a lot of vibes and thought just mm -hmm. the way it was. And I said, let me see. Very thought-provoking, yes. Yes, yes. It, it's it's, it's kind of almost like the eyes of the elders in, in a sense. Wow. But, you know, when I look at it, you know, it, like there is uh, wisdom you know and it's looking at you and all you have to do is open your eyes and see it but absolutely anyhow, so much for interpretation so. absolutely that's what it's about <laughs> i'm loving that interpretation thank you oh yes 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 okay fantastic fantastic all right and will you give us a second one you, you want you one? want more of course of <laughs> okay course. so um I only have on wsth <laughs> and i want you to remember this experience because not only can you come here and talk but you can also show and and, and demonstrate so another um, one of the series that, uh, let's see, you know, uh, I have to pick and choose because I made copies. Hey, it's Actually, these prints, um, I made prints, so the prints will be available also. Um, the original will be available also. So um, you have three options, actually. Let me show you this one. Let me show you this one. Now, this one, if you thought that wavelength was thought provoking, this one is actually a three in one. So when you turn it and you turn it, you get three different images. So mm -hmm. the first one, this is finish line. All right, all right. Okay. You know what you see, tell me what you see. You know, I'm a kind of a science-oriented guy. Okay. And when I look at that, I think of the interconnection of the, the universe. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I'm just kind of into the, the universe, uh, uh, dark energy, the, the different forces that we're now understanding that it's not a void, that it's all in interconnected in Ashley. ways that we're just beginning to understand Ashley. and that's what I see what I see when I look at that okay so um, let's turn it this way mm. no images think of images popping up this this image here is called marathon science again for me Science again. Science again for me. When I see that, I think of the evolution uh, of uh, or the beginnings of, of life. We start with these small things and from single cell to multi cell. Wow. That's that's what I think of. Wow, that's that's a, that's very deep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um and I think I have one more. I think this was yeah. No. Yes. One, two. You know what? I'll, I'll throw out. I'll throw out a, a suggestion. You, you, you can, if you get a sponsor, somebody to sponsor it, yes, and, and and 
get the most uh, get get folks to give their their, uh, ah, their descriptions, their description. and then get a, like a three panel of people to read through them and and see which one is most you know <laughs> hits them the most way or whatever. So it's not like so it's, it's kind of name the art kind of thing. Yeah, okay, exactly because that's it's um. Well, let's get to this last image. Well, it it it's doing the 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 universe thing for me when it's I look at that is still what I see. So I want you to do you know how sometimes when you're smelling fragrances. And when you're when you're at a fragrance table and they have oh smell this smell this smell this see the senses see well now we're we're looking we're looking and so that's our sight mm -hmm. so with smell it's kind of like you gotta put it like smell coffee beans so you're so you're you're sort of like your palate like when you're tasting is fresh and then you can taste another item well I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a few blinking moments and then you look at it again so it's kind of like trying to get a fresh idea because you're stuck on the universe mm -hmm. type thing so i want you to get fresh idea and i want you to just blink a few times refresh your mind and then look at it again and see if you can see it with new eyes okay, okay? so let's um so we did finish line we did marathon and uh, one more time. So, folks, as you can see, I have my eyes mm -hmm. closed. Okay, clear and clearing out the cobwebs and everything. Mm -hmm. Okay. Think about the the series name. Think about marathon, finish line. This is photo finish. Try to let images come out to you. Instead of looking through through the lines, let the lines come at you. It takes on a kind of a, a three-dimensional puzzle. That's what I want you to a see. A three-dimensional puzzle. Mm -hmm. And for me, then you start seeing how does it all fit. And you start seeing shapes and forms. Exactly. That, are, that are inter interconnected. Mm -hmm. So that that's that's the best way I can explain it. Good, right excellent. Here. So <laughs> so now we're moving from from interplanetary, which is another, which is uh, the name of another piece, All right. well, and then we're 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 getting images. So that's that's the thought provoking part of it. Okay. And well, we, we only have really about five more minutes, and I say that because UV, okay. UVI is supposed to come in. Okay, uh, UVI is supposed to be joining us today. Uh, so so I'd, I'd like to, you know, you to talk more about your okay. exhibit. And, and Wonderful. Like okay, so um, like I said, the name of the exhibit is Strategy. This body of work is um, basically my life experiences and, and, and struggles and just everything from the last two, three years of my life. Um, it is a muse-inspired piece, and um, it's also an Eventbrite. So um, go to Eventbrite, look for strategy, and um, there are some VIPs. There are some. I treat my VIPs very well, very very well, and um, it's going to be up for 30 days. It's going to be at Tigway, which is at 69C King Street in Fredericksted, Freedom City. Yes. So, um, in fact, you said it's important to me because I'm a West girl. All right. <laughs> West All right. side. <laughs> yeah, well, my, my mommy was a West girl, and uh, my daddy was a East out in the bush guy. <laughs> and that's back in the days when they had no cell phone, but somehow they connected. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Probably at a party yeah. or some kind you know, of quadrille or something. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. So, um, I'm so happy to be able to, to contribute to getting the, the word out. And just keep us in mind, we do a uh, community calendar here. Oh, okay? wonderful. So next time you have another exhibit or anything going on, you spread the word, get your information to us as early as possible, and you get uh, you know, free promotion of, of that particular Absolutely. event. Absolutely, thank you. We want to, as much as possible, make sure that people can come out, see, and appreciate, especially when the the children are out there performing because they're not performing for themselves. For themselves, they're, they're exactly. Doing it for, exactly. For you to come out and, uh, yes, support them, encourage right. them, uplift them. Yes. 
All right, all right. Okay, so uh, in your teaching is art specific? Or? I am an art teacher, mm -hmm. yes. Um, I have, uh, I started my career at Juanita Gardeen in 2005, then I moved from there, I moved to um, Ricardo Richards. Actually, in 2012, I had a, a hiatus. Mm -hmm. I left and then I came, but that was the young era. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And then when I came back, I was at Ricardo Richards for two years, and then I spent a year at um, ULE, and then I moved to junior high during the pandemic. And so um, now it's uh, it's well, just me, just focusing on my art, focusing on my work, you know, just really just. Well, I'm glad that you you've been to those to various ground. schools because you you. you in essence, kind of pollinated a lot of different. Things. I did. I felt like I, I felt like I left good ground there. I felt like um, those seeds have already been flowering, and the little bees are buzzing. And I have students that actually, you know, came like they're adults now, mm -hmm. and they're like, Miss Edwards, I'm not, and they hug me, and they, you know, we're learning this now, and they're all in high school, and so it, it, I felt that I just made a difference, you know, with with our youth and and just it, it's a it's a label of love actually just being a teacher is a label. if you trust me if you don't want to be a teacher find another career please because <laughs> well, these children need you <laughs> i i am right there yes i'm right there with you have you. to love teaching you have to just love it i'm right there with you your heart has to be mm -hmm. in it and if your heart isn't in it, then get out. <laughs> don't, just, don't be just there. Just find another career that you love that you exactly, can into. Exactly, you know? exactly. When, when, when I get the opportunity to talk to students, I, I, I tell them about that in particular. The worst thing to do is to work a job you can't that, that you can't, right. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's okay to work a job as part of the transition to going to where you want to go. Right. You know, that's, that's okay. But make sure but you do what you love. Do what you, you know, love. do what you love. Mm -hmm. Find some joy in it, you know. And, and you know, when you do that, there, there are some struggles. You're going to struggle. Mm -hmm. It's inevitable. But the love for the, for, for, for the task comes out of it, and, and it shows. So just, just keep doing what you love, you know. That's, that's, that's what I'm doing. I'm doing what I love. I find, I find a niche and I, I grab it and I I mean zoom. <laughs> All right, well I have to come down there and, and check Please out do. your art and, and see the, the full collection, folks. Yes. When you go down to Frederickstead, you know, you, it's called uh, Club Sixty Nine now. No, it's, it's actually Taiway. Oh, Taiway now. Yeah, T A I G U A Y okay. Taiway. Okay. Um, I thought that that was. Okay, good. Yeah. Good. Thanks, thanks for updating me on that. Yeah, no problem. Okay. Um, so I'm thinking because they have all these different places in there. It was yeah, it, it's right. It's right between the dive shop and and Kentucky Fried Chicken. It's just mm -hmm. beautiful. Walk hacienda. Right, yes, walk it's right blue in and white. It has an awning. It's gorgeous. Right, yeah. You walk right in. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, and uh, my good friend Ariella is around the corner inside there also, and among other people. Okay. So folks, come on down. Come on down. The 30th is the opening event. At 6, at 6 p.m. At 6 p.m. Mm -hmm. And you can see this young lady's lovely artwork. Appreciate it. Bring the children. No. No, no children? It's, oh, it's, oh, okay. it's a bit provocative. So. Oh, okay, no, no, if it's yeah. provocative. Oh, see, yeah. oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Child care food coming after so me. So wait, now. I put that on the bed, right? <laughs> very, 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 I, I said, under 17, please. Uh, my goodness, no. I hope somebody out there going to come on. I really don't want to have to explain to a child what this looks like. <laughs> Only on WSD. <laughs> <laughs> enjoy it. Oh my uh, goodness. Enjoy it. Okay. Well, that's 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 understandable. The same thing with with uh, when I go to a play every now and then. You have those that are everybody, and then those that's that they say exactly. we do not recommend. We don't, I don't. I do not. It's 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 something I don't want to say. Then go. Mm. Uh, <laughs> well, it kind of looks like. Um, <laughs> 
Good thing, good thing. Well, it's been a it's been a pleasure having you in here. Thank you so um, much for having me. Okay. Uh, and but I'm gonna hold on to you just for a quick second. Mm -hmm. We're gonna do some. Okay. So, folks, we're gonna do some uh, ads here for our sponsors and supporters. And I want to say thank you to this station and its supporters for supporting our format, our community-minded format. And we'll be back in a minute. WSDX AM 970, your community-minded station. Yeah, we went round the corner up the street and came back, okay? <laughs> but um, the we, did, we didn't stop nowhere, <laughs> okay? You know, your parents dispatch you out to do something and don't stop no, nowhere. <laughs> come, go there, come back. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Okay, so we got UVI here waiting in the wings to come in in a minute and so we're gonna finish up here with Miss Edwards uh, with her art exhibit and she has a special offering that she wants to make to the community um, you want to go ahead and tell me about that so yeah um so I'm gonna offer a ticket I don't I don't know how you do it do it we well, call in or well it's a physical ticket oh no um I have a um, I have a Facebook page. It's called Cetia. Spell it out. C it yeah S um not S I'm sorry C E uh -huh. I T mm -hmm. Y A Cetia. Okay. Create uh, arts and creative design. It's on Facebook, and um I'll give out two tickets to the first. You want them I want I, I want I want you want them to contact you on Facebook or yeah I want to go on the Facebook page okay. like the page share the page and the first to do that and then now I'll start let's see it's 906 now 906 now so let's let's start that at about 915 first person that does that like the page share the page with their response will get a ticket to my show strategy for right. Saturday. Fantastic, folks. See it, yeah. See it, okay. yeah. C e i t y a. Mm -hmm. And that's that's the thing. You've got to to realize it's a, a, a play on phonics here in a sense. Okay. <laughs> C e i t c e as in C, not S e e C no. e. It and yeah. Right. Okay. Why? Yeah. Okay. See it, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so. If you go to that page and like and share the page, the first one that matches her timeline, which is 906, the first one after 906 that does that, will get a free ticket to the opening event. Okay? Yeah. All right. Fantastic. So, plan to have some fun. Plan to take in some wonderful art in the process. Bump into some people maybe you haven't seen in a while. Mm -hmm. You know, meet some new people. Yes. But it's all good. Enjoy and, some hors d'oeuvres. And it's all there for mm -hmm. you. As I tell people all the time, you are the special ingredient in everything that happens here. It's all about people. People are the special ingredient. And the special invitation to come on out and see the exhibit strategy. All right. Good thing. Thank you. Thank you for coming in. Oh, my pleasure. It was a wonderful surprise. Thank you surprise. for having me. Oh, I love surprises. <laughs> I, love, I love surprises. <laughs> All right, fantastic. All right, folks, so we're going to transition here now, and I'm going to be bringing in UBI. Thank you again. Thank you so much for having me. Okay, fantastic. All right. <laughs> 